All right, let's talk about buying a Toto in Japan and installing it in the US. The conclusion is it works. And I guess here's some of my tips I want to document. Uh, I believe a three prong version of this exists, but the most common one is two prong with a little, you know, ground. They have appliance socket underneath. They have like a ground oh, connection area in Japan, but you know, I messed up. So I have this. I'm not grounding it right now. Still works, but for safety, I'll figure this out later. I don't know, I might have to like open it up and like screw it in somewhere. The plumbing, okay, so the thing that comes out, it's pretty much a standard brass fitting. Uh, ignore some of this, this is kind of like I did whatever to get it to work. But what you need to know is it's pretty compatible with the American pipes. Uh, one thing I noticed is they don't have um, the same kind of fitting. They kind of have like one side is a little tube then the other side couples into it with a perfect fitting o-ring that's the part that's watertight and around the whole thing is what we expect to see this thing but this isn't watertight all this is is holding it in place in fact it's kind of loose oh, i can't show it right now but it pretty much rotates i think they do that inner fitting o-ring just so everything's live and rotatable i think that's kind of cool yeah, besides that, and maybe you have to rig something together like this. It's not going to be even possible to set this up. Yeah, so here goes that. Um, part two, the, the auto flush. So in American markets, we have an auto flush feature. And it goes with like the washlet plus the washlet. But... I'm here to let you know that it is exactly compatible. So when I bought this toilet, obviously it needs to come with something. So I just chose randomly. I probably should have chose a little better. Just know that this cable that comes out is exactly the same connector as this. That's why I could just hook up the American ones straight to the Japanese Toto and it works. Yeah. just. No, be careful when you're buying this. I thought I was gonna get a bunch of, uh, here, see. It's like, oh, depending on your options, it will give you a different set of buttons. So you can, the buttons are there, but we'll cover it with plastic if you can't use it anyways. So I accidentally got the one with one flush. So there it is, one flush, even though this one has two, four and a back, and I'm sure this Cable knows how to encode that and send it, but too bad. I got the one with one button because of the choice that I made here. So you make it be a little more careful there and get the correct number of buttons. They won't send you like every combination. I think the washlet plus for America sends you every single button when I got it last time. So it's caught off guard. Anyways, works. I don't know what else to show. Auto flush. All right. Just wanted to let people know, you know, the yen is cheap. You can get like a Toto for practically 40% off if you buy it from Japan. It's just a kind of a pain in the ass to lug it back home. If you need, I don't know, luggage space or it's too heavy. Anyways, that's all.